Hi everyone, in today's video I want to talk about and demonstrate Bliss's fabulous skin reviving rubberizing mask. It is as fun as it sounds. Um, it's really cool. I've never tried a peel off mask or a rubberizing mask so I was definitely excited to try it and I received this for free to review and I've tried it a couple of times and what this does according to the packaging is that it refreshes the skin fends off free radicals and calms the skin it also helps even out skin's tone and texture leaving skin vibrant and I can definitely uh, speak on the refreshing part I definitely feel that and it does leave my skin looking vibrant afterward um, so it's definitely great. It has seaweed, bilberry, and vitamin C. And yeah, it's just so cool that you can try this mask at home. So you can bring the spa with you. And you can just put it on and put some cucumbers on and have a ball. So I'm going to show you how it works. And stay tuned if you want to see. In the package you get six masks so um, you get the mask you get spatulas to mix it up you get a scoop to measure the amount of water that you need for each mask what I'm going to do is dump the contents into the bowl so we have that Then I'm going to fill the scoop up with some water that I have standing by. And trust me, the one scoop is enough. So I'm going to pour the scoop into the bowl. So there we have the mixture. Uh, when you're mixing it, the uh, mixture is going to change color. So right now it's white. And you're going to mix it up quickly. You want to do this really quickly. It's almost like baking a cake. It's a lot of fun mixing it all together. You want to make sure that you get all of those lumps out when you're mixing it up. And see, already it's changing color. Now it's kind of like this grayish, purplish kind of a color. So you're going to mix quickly. Okay, so I finished mixing it up, so I have this smooth paste. And I'm going to use my hands to apply it, but you can also use the spatula if you like. But I find that the spatula was too slow for me, so I decided to use my hands because it's faster. And you're going to put it all over your face, but avoid the eyes because you never need anything like that around the eyes. Um, and on your neck. Make sure you apply it on your neck too. And trust me, it's plenty. You're going to have mask left over. So going to apply a thick layer since I always have some mask left. And you want to avoid your hair because I had to use a paper towel. I couldn't even use my hand to get it off of my hair. So see like I've got some on my eyebrows. I would even avoid the eyebrows if possible. But it's not too much of a pain on the eyebrows at least but on the hair I had to work to get it off so try to avoid that as much as possible and that's why I'm wearing a bandana to pull the hair away from my face you're gonna leave this on for 15 to 20 minutes until the mask rubberizes and do I look like a psycho because I think that's the whole part, the best part of the whole thing, is how crazy I look. Okay, so wait for 15 minutes, and then I'll be back to peel it off. So I let the mask sit for a little over 15 minutes. You can keep it on for 15 to 20, and now it's time for the big reveal. I'm going to peel it off. Isn't that the creepiest thing you've ever seen in your life? Oh my god. So, 
I was thinking that this would be perfect if you're a woman over 40 and you know you have this in your stash and when you feel the hot flash coming on put this on I am telling you it is totally gonna cool you off <laughs> you're gonna get this like or at least I get this weird little like crust on the edges of the mask so I just take like a damp washcloth but in this case I just brought a paper towel and wipe it off but you know it might be a good time like you know even in the shower you could just get rid of whatever is left but it comes off really easily the hair is a different story but on your skin it's a lot simpler to remove finished removing the mask and after I use it I definitely feel that my skin is softer to the touch it still feels very refreshing it still lingers even after I removed it I noticed that my skin looks like it's glowing a little bit so definitely some brightness going on with that and it's just you know a lot of fun to do so I hope you guys enjoyed the demonstration as much as I did and you can find the mask on Bliss's website, blissworld.com. You can order it from their catalog, their 1-800 number. It's also available at Sephora and Ulta. Um, I received this mask for free, and I hope you guys um, enjoyed it, and I'll see you next time. Bye.